Okay, we're gonna make this attempt one of drinking what system. This could be a very long video, so feel free to skip ahead and back and forth. And I'll try to write down times that things happen in the description, probably tonight, if this even works. So there will be naked babies in this video, as making her drink and watch. She can't be closed through the whole process. I need to see things. So we are going to take off her little hat. And I made a video that I published already about the tools I'm going to use and my ideas. So I might stop this and start if things aren't going properly. I kind of play it by ear, but I don't want to damage her. So um, it will be played by ear. Um, there will be girly bits in this video. So if you don't like them, don't watch. I'm sorry. I can't make a video of making a silicone baby, a solid silicone baby drinking wet if we don't show her bits. Sorry. So she is a solid silicone. She is 12 pounds, 23 inches of goodness. I love her to death. Um, I think I might keep the name Daisy. I'm just not sure. I mean, ultimately I need to kind of repaint her a little bit, but I'm kind of scared to do that because I'm not very good at it. It's expensive. So first thing is to make her a drink of wet. The second thing is to order the silicone paints and the sealant and the silicone glue, the silic all the silicone. It's like $100 for all the stuff you need to paint them properly to them to make it stay. I've been looking at other ways of painting, but it's another video. So here's baby girl. Um, so yeah, there's going to be parts in this video. I'm sure I don't make enough. I don't care about demonetized because I don't make enough, I don't enough viewers for that. So, <clears throat> so we're going to cut a slit right down the lower bits right there. And I have to watch doing that because I can't make this all about you guys when I have to do this properly. So I'm trying to think of which one will be the sharpest tool in the shed. Not me. Just cut a bit of it. Anyway, things you don't need to know. Okay. I think I did the wrong way. One tool, if this one doesn't work, we'll pull another one out. So cut a little slit. Upper for jingle jingle. This is always so awkward to do because I shouldn't be cutting a whole child's jingle jingle. Uh, there. So what I did was I just shoved it in. I don't want to make the hole too, too big. It needs to be big enough to have, I'm going to kind of advance it. It needs to be big enough to fit the tool that I'm going to do. Uh, I'll see if you guys can see this. It's kind of hard. So I just cut a little slit. That's all. That's all it needs. It doesn't need a massive hole. So then we're going to stick. Oh, now I chose a new knitting needle. This is like a 15 inch. It's a long one. Knitting needle because I want it to go all the way up. I'm going to leave this on because once this knitting needle reaches the back of her throat, I'll cut a slit. Once it reaches, this comes out, this stays in. And then I'll feed the tube up and see if this works. So... Lube. We are going to use a lot of lube on this girl because I don't want anything to rip. Uh, she was really, really powdered. Oh my gosh, just, I forgot how. This is stupid. I can't say it's slippery. Yeah, it's lube. It's slippery. I kind of lube all around the outside and my hands are all lubed up. Because I, this one just, I had a different type of lube and it, it came out a lot slower. So we're going to lube everything up on this. And I'm going to try to lube the bottom part without it. Just the part that's going to go in her. Yeah. I've got to wash this anyway. So. <sighs> Last time I was all over the place with these videos. So my goal is as I enter this to try to feel where it's going into. It's not very easy to push in. So I go slow. I don't want it to damage her body to go through her back. So this is a slow process. You can, I mean, she's solid silicone. So there's a lot to go through and okay so is that through once the stainless steel straw gets through her little girly bits I try to make sure the part the outside parts aren't stuck at all this is not going in very easily oh my gosh okay 
<laughs> I'm gonna pause this at five minutes and come back once I have it up far enough because it's really hard to push, but I will just make it, it's going through. It's just, I need to be able to focus on pushing this up and not getting it through anywhere else on her body. So I'll come back in a minute. Not going so well. <laughs> She's thick. The girl is thick. I understand now why some people have used power tools to do this. I will refuse. This looks bad. When I show you what she looks like, you need to be forewarned that this looks bad. Okay. I tried to get the knitting thing up. It went out her back. back. Tried to get up. It almost went out her neck. Then I was watching it and I saw it starting to push and it pulled it back. So eventually I just pulled the knitting needle out. And I, and I left the tube in her jingle jingle, the, the stainless steel tube, drop, and I started going through her head. <laughs> so now she has a stainless steel tube coming out of her vag and a metal skewer in her head. The two have not met. I'm sweating. I'm trying to find out where they are, why they haven't connected, and that's where I'm at. I don't want to get frustrated. I don't want to ruin her. I mean, I know the little, like, the little bit that came out her back. I can easily fix with glue that I have. And she is horribly covered in pet hair because my dogs sit on my bed and she's been on my bed. Girl's going to get a bath, a nice bath as soon as we're done. And she'll get a great powdering. I'm not giving up. She will be done by tonight. It's just a matter of figuring out why the two haven't met. I'm going to end up pulling the tube out of her, the pull out of her head to try to match up with the one down here because <laughs> sorry guys this is why I make this video so you know what to expect it is hard work to do this it is not easy this really is a two adult job because you need strong hands and you also have to watch what you're doing because you don't want to damage them because I still love this girl and I don't want her to have a bunch of holes coming out of her body except for the one for the mouth and the, the end so we've got the uh We've got the uh, metal tube sticking out of her vagina, and I'm trying to make it as G-ready as possible because I don't want to get in trouble. So that tube's coming out of her vagina, and that's going in her head. So they have not met in her body at all. Beep. I'm trying to find out where the top tube is, where the this one has gone, how far. I know it's gone. This top one has gone to the back of her throat, but I'm not sure how much further down it has gone the stainless steel straw is not long enough to go up her body and I really don't want to take it up much further because it's really hard to take out. There is lube in this girl. There's lube in the straw. There is lube on the outside of the straw. Excuse me. They're, they're everywhere. So that it doesn't rip her, her silicone coming out. Coming out, it will be a very, very slow process so that it doesn't. So that's where I'm at now. Still working on it. As soon as I can get the two connected and the straw going and the, the tube for it, I will make another video. But you guys are just bear with me here. Like I said, it's going to be a long video. Progress. Kind of. <laughs> so they're up the tube and the it's, it's up. I can feel it in her mouth. So <clears throat> it's up. I don't want to bend her. It's up, sorry, in her mouth. I can reach in and I can feel the tube. It's way back, but I can feel it. The issue is I can now have to find out how to get the, oh, it's not gonna, I don't think it wants to just fall out. The skewer does not want to come out now. <laughs> so now I have the skewer and the tube up her vagina and I cannot get the skewer out. I cannot fit this darn tube up with the skewer in there. <laughs> So, our next problem is getting the skewer out of her. Yeah, that's our next problem. <laughs> oh, this poor girl. She's going to get such a nice bubble bath. Such a nice powdering when we're all done with this. Oh, this poor girl. She is such, such a trooper. I love this girl. She's so sticky right now. I will get there. 